Right, this could, be, <coughs> this could be the third or fourth video. Short video. I've just come following the West Mendip Way, just crossed over a field and crossed a little stile there, heading towards Shipham now. The top end of Shipham. There was another track that I'll do another time because uh, my main interest today is conquering more of the Robero Warren than usual. So I'm making my way. I know there's cows by those trees there, big black ones, but I'm, I'm keeping down here, out of the way. They're up there in the shade. They haven't spotted me. I spotted them way back before I even got in the field. Over there, on the hill, that's Roebarrow Hill Fort. Iron Age Hill Fort over there. There's another hill fort there. I've got a feeling that could be Cadbury Hill. And one day I need to explore that hill there. I haven't got so much to do, you can't do it all at once. So I'm just doing... It won't be very good, the video. That's why I'm going to do very long on this one, because the wind... will be very windy. You might have to turn the volume down this little bit, of, little bit of a stretch because what I'm doing is doing small bits of video is on, on the journey as reference points for anyone who wanted to download it at all because you can download things I mean right over there in the distance for example is the back of, Breen, of um, Crooks Peak the walk over to Crooks Peak that way And we've done all that the other week. Now we're this way. It's Western right over there. That's Western. Or it could be Cleve. That could be Clevedon. Actually, Western might be further along. I don't know. That could be Western. They look very similar, actually, from a distance, those two. There are some cows. I've sat down. So what I'm doing, I'm just being careful. And uh, if I have to, I'll jump over the hedge. I'll get over it, don't you worry. They're up there, they're not interested in me. It's when they stand up you've got to worry. <sighs> to be quite honest, they shouldn't even put cows in a field if they're going to be frisky. But um, there they are, look. It's only when they get curious you've got to watch out. Now I have done this before. This takes me down into a little copse down the bottom there. I'm trying to not look at them because I don't want to draw their attention. I never used to be that worried by them until I got chased by a herd. It does put you off and also that particular year two people were killed by cows. Their dogs weren't. The dogs could run and get out of the way. They were trampled to death. See cows can trample you to death even if they're being friendly. Once you fall over, they just, one stood up now, see they're curious. That looked like a bull as well. He's just stood up, because they're curious, you see. And there's another one standing now. So I best get down here before they get too curious. Like I said, they can knock you over, and then they're so curious, they come up, and they tread on you. You see? And once they start treading on you, you've had it. Now there's nothing to stop those cows from coming down this valley. And I bet they do come down here. There's not a lot of evidence of cow pack. But, uh, yeah, we go down through this little valley now. And then we're, in a minute, I'll be going over a little bridge across a stream. And on, then the other side of this valley will be Shipham. I'll go past St. Leonard's Church. Then I'm looking for something called, I can't pronounce it because I've got my glasses on. Something Lipiet Lane or something. But I, I guess yeah, they do come here. Look, there's cow pack. There's cow pack there, look. I timed it well because they could have easily have come here, you see. Now that's not very clear, is it? It's a good job I know the way. You can't walk through there. Okay, how it's signposted. 
you can go that way or that way. I'm going down the steps. But anyway, before I go on this particular video, over and out for now. <laughs>